It's done. What's well, done? This. What's that? Can't you read? It says time machine. Why do you need one that big? What are you talking about? My cell phone tells me that it's time, and it's the size of my palm. No. Listen. This machine can send objects forward into time. Wow, that is... Uh, something's happening to me! Well, what is it? I'm, I'm going forward through time! It's amazing! I think I'm still doing it! That's not what I mean. This machine can send objects days, months, ears into the future. That's not possible. Machines like that don't exist. It's like the unicorn or a condom that fits me. It's a shame they don't make them smaller. But this thing really does work. I know, it's like the little engine that could. <sighs> Talking about the time machine. Oh, yeah, I knew that. I'll prove it to you. It's gone. Nice trick, David Copperfield. It's not a trick. It didn't disappear. It's actually ten years in the future. Or it's behind my ear. No. It's in the future. If you wanted to prove that it worked, why'd you send it ten years into the future and not ten minutes? That way I could see it as it came through its wormhole. Shut up. Do it again, but try it that way. I can't. It needs to charge up. And that takes three days. Well, in that case, it's a damn good magic trick. It's not a freaking magic trick. You think you're some kind of fucking scientist, but all your inventions are fucking worthless and stupid. And your miming is any better. I thought you liked my mime version of Reservoir Dogs. Thanks. I want you to see my other invention. You gonna levitate? No. Bobby Harbour's Drink Remix? Is this Kool-Aid? No, this isn't Kool-Aid. This is the future of drink mixes. You get it from the time machine? Just watch, asshole. No sugar, no stirring. It's just magic. Taste it. This is better than Kool-Aid. At a fraction of the price. What are you talking about? This tastes like it costs a fortune. Most retailers would sell this fantastic product for a dollar a packet, but since you're buying direct from the manufacturer, I'm practically giving it away for five for a dollar. Wait, what? Five for a dollar. But Kool-Aid is just four for a dollar. You're gonna put them out of business. I'm going to destroy them. <laughs> when I was younger, I had nobody. My dad was out selling Bibles and my mom was in the traveling freak show. She was the accountant. I was left at home alone for months at a time with nothing but 1,000 packets of Kool-Aid and 300 cups of instant noodles. Sometimes I would cry myself to sleep. It eventually got better when I discovered late night Cinemax. But through all those times, the good and the bad, there's one man who stuck by my side. The Kool-Aid man. He taught me to always have a smile on my face and live life with a can-do attitude. Oh yeah, I cannot let Bobby destroy him. I must destroy him first. I'm going to ruin his invention. I'll get you, you son of a bitch. I forgot how good this was. That doesn't taste funny to you at all? No, t <coughs> Something's wrong. Are you okay? <coughs> oh shit, Bobby, I didn't mean for this to happen. You did this. I'm sorry, Bobby, I didn't mean for this to happen. I just wanted you to forget about your damn drink remix. See you in hell. Ugh. Oh, Bob. You know, today's the 
10 year anniversary of my killing you, which I was acquitted for. Oh, I miss you, and I'd give one of my nuts to have you back, if I still had my nuts. Well, who knew that Mexican whore's pimp was Shylock? God, I love you, and rest in peace, Bob. Is that sick for you, Roy? I don't know who the fuck that is. I'm me. I I'm you. You're me? I'm you. Who am I? You're you. Oh, so that makes you... You. You're you? Yes. You're you, too. So we're both you? Yes. But who's you? I... Stop! He's old MCR, ten years from now, in the future. You're kidding me. Tell him something only he would know. <laughs> well, uh... They find a cure... In about five years. <laughs> hey, nice to meet ya. No, don't touch each other! The universe will explode. Like my dick last night! Yeah. No, no, no! You idiots, what does that mean? Do not touch each other. How can I? He's a handsome man. All right, I knew that was coming. Oh, is, is it staying my jeans? Stop this nonsense. Why are you in that box? When am I not in a box? I'm funny. Let's just get serious. All right, I missed you. But not your hair, asshole. You know that drink remix? I accidentally killed you because of it. Became a bomb, saw the shark, came through a wormhole, and jumped through it to warn past MCR not to kill you. Why'd you kill me? I don't know, it hasn't happened yet. The Kool-Aid man is like a father to me. And the drink would destroy him. Asshole! I didn't know it was a big deal to you guys. Guy, you. I'm sorry, I'll destroy it all. Thanks. Whoa, nice suit! I'm having a butterfly effect headache! You okay, man? The pioneers are still famous. Still famous? Still famous. Well, I think we finally got this figured out. I think we do too. Let's celebrate the last of my drink remix. Yeah! <laughs> Here, let me help you. Wait! Cheers. Cheers. This tastes funny. Tastes fine to me. Got you again! <laughs> uh, uh oh. I got you too! Uh -oh, you fucker! <laughs> oh, behold! I am dying! Dirt! Uh, shit, me too! Oh, fuck, I didn't think this through. My equal MC squared for Bobby Harvard MC all on the MC squared. In the future, we're growing in the show. In the future, I'm blowing my nose. In the future, I use a card in hope. In the future, I still have ten toes. In the future, I steal a card in no. In the future, I answer the phone. In the future, my tire gets blown. And in the future, the pioneers are going to be in their own.